Hey everyone, and welcome to part 3 of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword with me, your LP Guru. Last time, we found out that our good old loft wing is missing, and now we're gonna find it! So, let's, <laughs> let's see what these guys are talking about. You know, Groose, that sure was pa that sure was a pain, but with all that scratching and pecking... <clears throat> what are they talking about? Of course it was. You thought a big crimson loft wing like that was gonna go down without a fight? Crimson loft wing, but that's our color. What could they have done? But we got it, and I don't care how tough that bird is uh, supposed to be. He's not getting out of the, <laughs> that pet anytime soon, boys. <clears throat> oh, I'm gonna kill these guys. This is. So, yes, this is Groose, the jerk of the game. <laughs> Whoa, Guru! So, uh, yeah, just how long you been standing there? <laughs> Uh, what's your problem anyway? Oh wait, I got it. You're here to talk ab about today's race. I can see it in those dopey eyes of yours. They're pleading. Oh, Groose, can you please find it in your heart to let me win today, please? You're just desperate to win so you can get some alone time with Zelda up on the statue of the goddess at the end of the ceremony. <laughs> Do you like the Rocky voice I'm giving him? <laughs> Oh man. Well, sorry, pal. Goose doesn't do charity for whips. My advice: work, work hard and wish with all your heart. You might even come in second. Ooh. Look at his retarded eyes and lips and hair and face. <laughs> Say, come to think of it, how come I don't see your bird? Where is that scruffy pile of red feathers? I'm going to kill him. <laughs> <laughs> I can't imagine you could've, what could've happened. Do you think his tiny brain got confused by the clouds? Bring it on. <laughs> I will punch you. Pfft, sure, only thing is, I don't know how you're going to do that with no bird. You gonna grow wings? No, I'm gonna beat the crap out of you. That's what's gonna happen. <laughs> you know, we're all getting tired of how you never let anyone forget you and Zelda go way back. <coughs> Jealous. <coughs> you and Fred since you were kids, big deal. It doesn't change the fact that you float through life with your head in the clouds. Would you wake up, straighten up, and grow a backbone already? I'm the most courageous person in the world, but okay, whatever. <laughs> Dokes like you are dragging our honored academy through the mud. And just who might you be talking about, Groose? Oh snap, Zelda has got to come save us again. <laughs> oh, Zelda, hey, no, it's, uh, 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 uh. Oh, she's, oh, she's pointing the finger. You're screwed, man. <laughs> Don't even try it, Groose. You're picking on Guru again, aren't you? Really sad that she has to save us for getting picked on. <laughs> uh, he's a student at the Academy like all of us. Uh. <laughs> Look <laughs> at his dope face. Derp face. <laughs> Why do you insist on bullying him around so much? Yeah, I suppose. <laughs> He's just like staring at her eyes. You suppose? Suppose what? I suppose you were. Oh, he's such an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> Forget it. I was supposing anything, okay? <laughs> He's so jealous. <laughs> Get ready, here, boys. Later, Guru. Hope you find a bird. <laughs> uh, now nah, we're gonna kill him. We will destroy him. All of his hopes and dreams. <laughs> that's just that's just how Link rolls, you know. I hate to say it, but I'm beginning to suspect that those blockheads had something to do with your Loftwing's disappearance. Guru, those guys aren't going to help you find help us find your bird. So we'd better start searching. Yes, enough with the cutscenes. Let's let's go search for our bird, yes. I'll fly on this guy left, okay? Good. Good times. Father said he 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 talked to Instructor Orwell about delaying the start of the race. Good, okay. We'll find our bird. Let's do it. Uh, I, wonder, I wonder how they feel like the first time you ever have to do that when you're like a little kid. I wonder how, I wonder how that works, you know? 
Like, alright, now just jump off the edge. <laughs> alright, so. Let us go find our bird. Where could it possibly be? I have no idea. <laughs> Hi, person. Okay, I do know where it is. So let's go. Let's just go get that bird thing. Hi, little person. Alrighty. So, yes, it's over here. I believe. Yes, okay. Actually, it kind of showed us this in a little cutscene back when we were talking to Gabe Cora. Five rupees. <laughs> So many just random rupees and trees. Hmm, big cave. Looks important. Let's see what's in, what's inside. What's going on? <gasps> That's our bird. But we cannot get in right now, as you can see. Yeah. Let's read, read our sign here. Waterfall cave. You were a blood-sucking monster. Is no kids allowed? Okay. Well then, I wonder how we can get through this wood. Hmm. You know, guys, I, I think it's time we go get our sword. You know, I, I, I'm, I'm, that, I'm feeling it. I'm feeling sword. <laughs> Alrighty. Let's just go, let's go do stuff. Yeah. You know it. <laughs> Alright, well, how are you guys doing? How are you guys enjoying the, the, the LP so far? I'm loving it. I'm really enjoying it. This is, uh, it's Friday. For, gonna get down on Friday. So that's good. I won't be able to record this weekend, so I'm recording more today to get more parts out. Yeah! Yeah! Oh, uh, what? I want another five rubies. Whatever. Alright. We gotta get to the sparring hall, which is just over here. I'm running out of stamina. Alright. Hi. Hi, Pepit. <laughs> I don't want to talk to you. Alright. Uh, Alrighty. Here we go. Let's talk to this guy. No, I don't think we need to talk to him. Yeah, okay, we can just go back here. Alright. Here we go, guys. Our first treasure chest. Yeah! Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do! You got the thing! Alright, I had to do it once. I'm, I'm done. I will do it again, I promise. You gotta practice swords. Students at the, ca the Knight Academy practice with these. It looks like it has a fairly sharp blade. Press 1 anytime to look at the items you're carrying. Alrighty. We got ourselves a sword. Oh yeah. You know it. So now... ka ha, ha. Alright, let's, let's cut up some wood. Uh, yeah! What? Uh, uh, yeah. There we go. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah. All right. All right. Yeah. <laughs> I really like the sword controls in this game. It's pretty sweet. That's right, Guru. You really are a strong swordsman. Easy to teach too. Are you ready for the spin attack? Yes. I'm ready to do the spin attack. <laughs> Great. I'm going to surround you with logs. Yep. Swing them horizontally. Gotcha. Here we go. I love this. Yeah. Perfect. Good one. That sure liked it. Felt good. All right. Yes. Fatal blow. Let's do that too. There are some really cool swords move sword moves in this game for sure. All right. So here we go. Slice. And then. Yeah. Oh yeah. Fatal blow is awesome. That's the way. Uh huh. Uh huh. I like it. A fatal blow is also an effective move to use right after you've used your shield. Shield? What? <laughs> when are we gonna get a shield? I think it's funny that we get our sword first. Yeah. Or a well-placed spin attack. Indeed. Alright. That is about it for just our basic sword attacks, but there are actually three others. If you flick them all, flick, flick both. We remote nunchuck backwards. Wait, uh, you'll do that one, which is kind of cool. It's like a backflip. Or if you do it frontwards, you'll do the same thing, just frontwards. And you can lock on. And if you uh, jump forward and then swing, you'll do that. Our jump attack. So that's cool. But now that we have our sword, we can go cut through that wood. Wait, what? Hey, Guru, what are you doing? Dang it! You can't take that sword outside the sparring hall. What do you think you're doing? <laughs> Well, sir, you see, I need to find a bird, so I need a sword, obviously. Oh, well, that's fine. <laughs> no problem, then. There you go. Just keep it. Who cares? Alrighty. 
Pretty easy. Just gotta talk to him. And now we can have a sword. Yay! Alright, let's go. Let's do it! Let's go get our freaking loft wing, shall we? Oh, we shall. Oh, yeah. Alright. Go! Yeah! Rolling! Oh, right. Shake a stone. There we go. Here's the shake a stone. Every game's gotta have one, right? <laughs> hey, friend, walk yourself over here. Here and say hello. Alright, fine. How do you do? I'm what you call a shake a stone. Glad to meet you. I'm a stone of few words, so I'll get right to it. You're going to find yourself in puzzling circumstances as you make your way through this world. If you should find yourself stuck and you have no idea how to move forward, come see me. Yes, it's how you can cheat. Awesome. <laughs> Alright. Well, that's that. Oh, God. Okay. <laughs> I had to do it. Alright, let's go. Let's do stuff. Let's go get our freaking bird, shall we? We shall. It's kind of just still part of the uh, kind of prologue stuff. But hey, you know, it's, it's good times. Ugh. Yay, rupees. Okay. Hi, grasshopper. Later you get a bug net, and, I'll, and you'll finally be able to, uh, yeah, catch those bugs, which is which will be nice indeed. Give me five rupees. Dang it! <laughs> I want five rupees. Whatever. This game hates me. All right. So, yes, we're gonna get our bird. It's gonna be awesome. <laughs> so yeah, I am. I yeah, I love this game. <laughs> it's so awesome. Uh, what's funny is uh. Kind of a buddy of mine, Winslet 13, Austin awesome Pier, is doing this game right now. Also, and he's doing a blind run of it, which and I'm and his LP is fantastic of it. And um, I'm actually, I, I think it's it, I I definitely am not doing it because he's doing it. I just love this game and like you know, but I think it's funny that we're both doing the same game. But hey, whatever. So I, I Winslet, I promise I'm not just copying you. <laughs> Alright, as you can see, we can cut up these trees now, which is kind of useless, but whatever. And, yeah, there we go. Cut through all this crap. And that sign, too. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, get rid of all of them. Come on. <laughs> this is one thing that's annoying, is that they sometimes, you have to do, like, certain slashes on them to make them disappear. But whatever. Anyway, <laughs> let's go in here. Go in the waterfall cave. And this is where we will find our first enemies! Ha! Ah, the keys! Okay. <laughs> They're dead. <laughs> I can't believe they take two hits. Uh, ridiculous. I'm so weak right now. <laughs> uh, da, chew! 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 Okay. <laughs> yes. Well, there we go. Those, that, was, uh, that was one of our chews. Little chews. And treasure chest. <laughs> 20 rupees! Yeah! Awesome. Alright. Forward! Ugh. I always like to break th to kill the grass, because, you know, you never know when there will be a ton of rupees in it. You know. You know how it is. And get me. Okay. Alright. Come here, Keese. Come here. Come here, Nagin. Come here. Alright. <laughs> Dang it! There's so many enemies in here. Actually, this is a uh, uh, wait. <laughs> it's a good place to uh, uh, grind for a certain item that the uh, keys give you. Let's see if it'll give me one. That'd be nice. So I could, you know, show it off a little bit. <laughs> no, really? Maybe over here? No? Okay. Well, I guess we'll see. Oh, hey, look! Our first recovery heart. <laughs> awesome. Okay. Well, I guess we'll talk about the items later then. <laughs> Unless this keys will give it to me. Yes. Yes, maybe. Murder death. Nope. Okay. They hate me. <laughs> but first, let's see what's over here. <laughs> Freaking grass. Okay, whatever. Bam. 40 rupees. Broke 100 already. Aren't we awesome? Alrighty. Kill this freaking grass. And we're out of the cave. Yay. Super exciting, I know. And now we can finally get our loft wing back. Yes. Yes. Let us go. Oh, wait. <laughs> Guru. Hi, Zelda. How's it going? 
Hey, Guru, I was hoping I'd find you here. What? How would she know that I would be here? That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> I heard you'd done, gone searching for your bird around the waterfall, so I thought I'd fly around and help you look. Thanks. Thanks. You are so you were so helpful. Not really. <laughs> How's your search going? Any sign of your loft wing? <laughs> yes, actually. <laughs> oh, no. Well, let's not lose hope yet. Actually, I know exactly where it is, but what you know, whatever. <laughs> huh? Hmm. What? <laughs> Who? Who's that? Who's calling for me? Oh, sorry, Guru. I got distracted for a moment. Let's go. Oh, that's probably not important at all. <laughs> anyway, bird. Yeah. <laughs> Look, there he is. Yeah. There's our loft wing. No doubt about it. That's your loft wing, Guru. Come on, buddy. I'll get you out of there. Try to break these barrels. All right. All right. So you gotta like do certain cuts. Which I'm failing to do. There we go. There we go. Yeah. All right. And yeah. Horizontal link. There we go. That was vertical, but whatever. <laughs> there we go. All right. He's free. Yay. Here he is, our crimson loft wing. He's so cool. I love. I love the look of him. It's pretty cool. Look at those feathers too. Like, Winslet already said this, but I agree. It, he looks a lot like either Kazooie from Banjo-Kazooie or Ho-Oh from Pokemon Gold. <laughs> Which totally... I, I actually really agree with the Ho-Oh one for sure. It's pretty awesome. Yeah! Look at him flying. It's awesome. Fantastic. And now we get to show off the, uh, the flying mechanic, yes? Yes. Yes, indeedy. But before you go, I have to ask you something. I, I heard this voice a few moments ago. Did you hear it too? Nope, you're crazy. <laughs> it's been happening a lot lately. It's the strangest feeling. Almost like someone is ta tra calling out to me. Well, that's probably not important at all to the story. You know, <laughs> Probably just a coincidence. <laughs> Some say that it's an empty, barren place. Or even that there's nothing all down there at all. Down below, blah. <laughs> nothing at all down below. But I just have this feeling that there's that they're wrong. Some of Father's old texts talk about a place called the surface. The old tales described a whole world under there, far more vast than Skyloft. The thing is, no one's ever been down there to see it. And our loft wings won't fly through the cloud barrier. But I can't help imagining the wild things that might be waiting below. Someday I want to see for myself. <laughs> oh, sorry, Guru. <laughs> we don't. We don't have to. T we don't have time to talk. Let's get going. Look, your bird's waiting for you. Just leap off the edge and press down. Don't worry about falling. Your bird will catch you for sure this time. Yeah. I think that'd be funny if, like, sometimes, just like a random occurrence like you press down and your loft wing just doesn't come because it just doesn't care. <laughs> That'd be pretty funny. Yeah! And we're free! <laughs> free falling! Sorry. <laughs> Kinda had to do it. Anyway, loft wing! And yeah! All right, so now we gotta we have to go through our kind of flying tutorial like thing. Yeah, look at that. It's pretty simple though. The controls really. It's pretty much you're just directing with your Wii remote. Guru, let, let's run your bird through the basics just to make sure he's not hurt. Gotcha. If you want to change the direction your bird is flying by tilting the Wii, Wii remote to the left or right. Yes. Right. Left. If you want to speed up. So we can move up to gain altitude, and then point it down to drop into a dive. Yes. Yeah. There we go. So how's he handling? Do you think he's flying all right? Yep. He's fantastic. Oh, riding loft wing? Yes. You can press 2 to go over controls, and you can press A to charge and burst to speed. B to slow down. Yeah! All right. Awesome. 
The sad thing about this game, though, is you can't name your Loftwing. I think that's really weird, because, like, you're able to name... I don't know. <laughs> I think it'd be kind of cool, but whatever. <laughs> well, that's a huge relief. I don't know about you, Guru, but your Loftwing's look looks like he's flying great. My father and the others are probably worried about your bird, so let's go give them the good news. Alrighty. Uh, yeah, the flying controls are pretty fun, and it, it takes a little... It's hard at, like, right at the beginning, it's kind of really hard to get control of it, but uh, it gets, it gets, you get pretty used to it, which is cool. But, I think that's the perfect time to end this part, so, I will see you guys next time in Let's Play uh, The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword, and we will, next time we will be doing the Wing Ceremony, which will be pretty cool, I'm sure. We'll see what happens, yes? <laughs> so yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in part four, bye-bye.